Hey, Enchanters, welcome to my 2022 Halloween Spooky Town Village. Let's go ahead, dive in, and take y'all in on this immersive, immersive little tour. And we're going to start here with back from 2009, the Witch's Brew House. I absolutely love, love, love this piece. Now, all these pieces, as you can see, the Witch's Rotate, all these pieces are, um, they do have sound. Uh, I don't have all the sound on, I only have the sound on one of them, but wanted to share that with you. Look at the incredible, incredible, incredible details on this one. And then we're gonna move on to Esmeralda the Great. This is new from 2022. My pieces are either 2022, uh, for the most part, and, 20, and 2009, sorry. This was back in 2009. I love this floating detail. <laughs> this looks amazing. I love all these little mini figs here. The Dr. Gory's Laboratory. I think this was released in 2021 or 2022. I'm not quite sure. It's one of my all time favorite pieces. Look at the detailing. That bubbling effect is just everything. The Shrobe electrical lights at the very top look incredible the octopus tentacles the brain matter it just looks amazing now this is a michael's exclusive this year and this right here is headstone mill brewery exclusive to michael's 2022 super duper duper cutie Love the windmill at the very top. Now this is one of my two villages. We're gonna take you on the next one shortly after. And that village set is my carnival set. My carnival set. And next year, we wanna kinda of put them all together and find a new spot for all of them. This is also brand new from 2022. And this is the Crypto Reaper, I believe is the name. I forget the name of this set. I love the flickering flames. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful set. We have the moss details. This right here was a tree I bought at Michael's and I wrapped an LED light, a total of two LED lights, and it really creates such a beautiful scene. It's the only thing that is not part of the spooky town village set. Love, love, love this bridge. As we come here, we have these lampposts right around the graveyard. So I have this little graveyard scene. I love this dude as well. This reaper with the lights looks amazing. We have another, another lamppost light there. All the cemetery tombstones. And this right here I absolutely love. This is the zombie bash, the graveyard party. It's amazing. Now this piece I believe is from, I think it's like 2020. I'm not too sure, 2021. Absolutely love that disco ball. It's absolutely freaking adorable. This is also a uh, new I, th this is also a Michael's exclusive. It's Agatha's Apothecary from 2022. It's a witch's house. And here's where they, uh, they're, it's an apothecary for witches. <laughs> There's the shop window. How amazing. I love this like effect, like this like neon plasma fluid effect here on the side. Looks amazing, amazing, amazing. Another incredibly sought after piece, this is the one you're hearing the sound from, is Forlorn Cemetery from 2009. I love this piece. It's small yet mighty. I love that thunder shrobe effect. That's where, again, that's where all the sound is coming from. The gargoyles at the very top. It's absolutely beautiful and goes great with this cemetery scene. Here we have a fog machine. And this is the Isle of Creepy Jack's fog machine. I love that fog component, it's, it's freaking amazing. 
has that nautical theme to it, but it does, I do, 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 do love that effect here on the village. Then we have, this is uh, the Opera House, also back from 2009. How beautiful is this? The rotating detail, it's like that rotating chandelier detail with the vampire. Absolutely incredible. This is the Michaels exclusive gloom room. This is the, one of the most sought after pieces of the 2022 series. It's very difficult to come across right now. It's sold out quite fast. And it just has so much happening around it. Look at the bar. That's amazing. The windows light up on the side. And then up top, you have all the zombies dancing away. It's absolutely incredible. Some more details here. And then we also have Morbid Manor. Back from 2009, this piece was released. The ghost in the window looks amazing. And now let's take you over and let's experience the carnival. And here we have our carnival display. As you can see, we have our village display on this end and our carnival on this end. So let's dive in and let's start off with my absolute favorite piece ever. This is brand new from 2022. It's the Count's Bat Bonanza. This piece is already retailing for over $300 right now in the secondary market. Very rare to come across Look how beautiful the details are. So you have the rotating Dracula at the very top. These tinted glass windows, which are gorgeous. And then look at all of the riders on these bats. This mechanism is incredible, incredible, incredible. And when you power it off and power it on, it, they literally retract back down and they come back up. We do have some wall, by the way, some wall uh, portraits as well. Uh, and stay tuned for a tour of the entire home later this month. Here we have the marching band playing. All these little mini fig pieces are amazing. The Witch's Brew coffee shop. I freaking love this piece so much. This is Ghost Around. And I love that it moves. It, 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 it goes up on a bias vertically like that. Oh, it's so amazing. All the riders in the car. I mean, it's so incredibly detailed. It's such a gorgeous piece. <laughs> Next, we have Bump in the Night. These go-karts, and they are just absolutely beautiful. I love these pumpkin light details here. I love that they they just they move around through the entire entire um, field of this. So they just don't stay in one position, which is amazing. I really, 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 really love that. As we come up here, we have this hot air balloon rotating. That's so freaking cutie. We got Frankenstein selling flowers. Another windmill in the back. And here we have another fog machine. I forgot to put water in it. And this one is Skull Cave Query. How beautiful is this piece? Yeah, it's a nautical theme, but I love the idea of having a water fog machine piece uh, intertwined with this. It adds an extra element. Now, the music you're hearing, because they all play music, and if you have all the volume on, it's very distracting and you don't hear any clarity, but this one right here, which is the uh, Merrick Around, is where you're hearing the music right now at the moment. How beautiful is this piece? Look at the details of this. The mirrors. It's just absolutely breathtaking. 
Here we have the clowns. They're really creepy. The skull in the well. We have a lot of moss details all over the place. There's another clown. Have these little rocks we created around the scene. Now this one, the pumpkin tilt and hurl, y'all. How beautiful is this piece? It is just absolutely magical. I love it. It's my, okay, I, it, right after the Bat Bonanza, this is definitely my second favorite piece followed by this one. I mean, look at this incredible detailing, y'all. Look at that. Just breathtaking. And then we come down here and we have another cemetery. And then here we have the pit pendulum. Look at these bat eyes on the base of this, how they flicker. That is so amazing. We have ice cream. We have a hot dog stand. And then this one is Web of Terra. Terror. This is the Ferris wheel. It is absolutely beautiful. Look at all the details. Every single uh, car of carriage has a different character within it. The lighting effect, look at that. I mean, these are just beyond amazing. We have this moon that also lights up. And then here we have um, this beautiful, what do you call those? Gondola, is that, is that what you call it? I think they're called gondolas. <laughs> and then we have this candy corner stand and we have another stand as well here. It's just an absolutely breathtaking scene. What are your thoughts on the Spooky Town by Lee Max? village collection do you own these i love to see your collection so in the commentary section share your social media handles if you're sharing any content uh i love to see your displays and again here is our other display stay tuned for so much more content i'm going to be showing you our entire home tour can't really see much but a lot has already been decorated and that's going to be a surprise so thanks for watching keep collecting enchanters don't forget to subscribe to this channel uh hit that bell button to be notified for more content and go follow me on tiktok and instagram at enchanting unboxing for exclusive content stay amazing keep collecting collectors happy halloween and until the next one